Ryan Astle's a, a fair point in the end for the New Saints? Um, considering we went down to 10 men quite early, well, in, early in the second half, I say taking the points was good, but felt like we could have held on at the end, but unfortunately a decision went against us, we're possibly offside, but yeah, it's, it's a tough one to take, but uh, we kept the unbeaten run going and we'll move on to the next game. And on a personal level, you got the New Saints goal, so you must be pleased with that. Yeah, it's another goal, but obviously it's disappointing we didn't get the win. But as I say, I've been talking myself to get as many goals as I can. And, and, try, and tonight, obviously, I probably should add a few more, the big scramble in the box. But to get, to get a goal, it's, it's always good, yeah. And the New Saints had several chances in the first half. Do you feel that it should have been more than a one-goal advantage come the half-time whistle? Yeah, definitely. They didn't. I don't think they got out their, their own half in the first half. And we had all the ball. We keep it made a good save. We had the post, a big scramble in the box. So on another day, we could have been four, five, six nil up maybe. But today, it wasn't a day. And when TNS went down to 10 men, how much of a turning point was that? Of course it is, because then they get a bit of confidence and they start throwing men forward. And obviously... That's at the end of the scene, how many players they had in the box, I think it was pretty much all of them in there, but it was it was a turning point, but I thought the lad, all the lads dug in, and it was right to the, nearly right to the end, and we just, we just got to the end and the three points. And four added minutes beyond the 90, and that's when Flintown United scored. Yeah, as I say, it's, it's heartbreaking, isn't it? but we've, we've got to put that behind us now, and we've got to move on. Um, obviously tonight it was a tough game, I think everything went against us, then we got one decision all, all night, and it was a, there was plenty of blatant decisions where the ref was just, just felt like he was against us. It felt like he was against an extra man. But as I say, we've got to move on now to the next game. But stepping back and looking at the big picture, 10 games played, unbeaten, eight victories, two draws. TNS is in a healthy position at the top. Yeah, we're in a great position, but we don't want to just be in this position. We need to push on now and, and keep keep winning, keep keep picking up the points and, and get further, further clear. And will the disappointment of this evening become a motivation for the visit of Cardiff Met next Saturday? Definitely, because obviously we need to win the next game now and keep keep the points ahead. So we'll go into training, we'll work hard and we'll go to Car get Cardiff Met back on our pitch and we'll hopefully pick up the three points.